<laughs> it's just been on. Yeah. <laughs> What's up, guys? Art with the La Farita. You're so behind the scene right now. Pizza truck. Eric with the hot box pizza truck. We uh, we're gonna go ahead and get this um, stack out of here. We uh, got the measurements for this piece of uh, panel we got to cut, and that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna cut this real quick and uh, get that put up, and then we can drop the pipe through and get it all secured and uh, caulked in because we got some rain coming later tonight, tomorrow morning. So we want to try to get this all You're buttoned chilly up. chilly here in Florida, man. <laughs> 65, I'm freezing. Tomorrow it's going to be 65, I think. We need to buy some coats. <laughs> <laughs> Let's light up the oven instead. <laughs> all right, guys, we're going to knock this out. We'll get back with you. See you. <laughs> How you doing guys? Another night at the truck. Today was a really annoying job that was fighting us all night long. But we finally got it to the point that it seems like it's working for us right now. Eric installing a bracket. As you can see, so we have a support. We're sitting on the roof of the truck. <laughs> Above a tree. We're supposed to get uh, some type of storm so no any day now so we want to finish with the we got from amazon we got sorry guys one hand operation we got this seal nut supposed to be 800 degrees 800 degrees Fahrenheit and we're gonna try to seal everything and we're gonna show you how it's look from inside as soon as we're done here on the roof Getting close. it's the the little painful jobs right now all right we've got the brackets all the way around and then we're gonna do the same on the bottom so four up top and four on the bottom, and the pipe's already nice and solid. I think we'll be good to go. We're not going to actually be able to seal it up tonight because the rain's making it on us, and I don't want to get it sealed up and then it pour down rain and it all be for naught. So we're going to wait, throw a little blanket or something around it for anything leaking down, and uh, let's go inside and finish up. <laughs> We just built a spark arrestor for this thing. Good evening. Oh, he just put a scratch in the roof. Monsieur and Madame. <laughs> they so, charge, uh, I don't know, like 25, 30, 40 bucks or something like that. For this, the spark this arrestors thing for alone these? cost around $200. Like it's from <laughs> 180 some to 200 some dollars. And they're not even sending it with this little net. Like, a, how you call it? Restor? It's a sp spark arrestor, yeah. Spark arrestor. So we took like a little chicken wire. My leftover chicken wire, yeah, from my garden and keeping the rabbits away and cut it, cut it down because that's all it is. It's just chicken wire, metal metal wire. Because I, when I did mine, I bought it not knowing. They send it without on the picture. They no, no, it. I bought it. Because I knew it was... Oh, you, know, you bought specific yeah, yeah, for I, the... Yeah, yeah, and How so, much they charge? Like, that's what I'm saying. I, I think, it, yeah, it was something crazy, like 30, 40 they bucks. They like to do this stuff. So we made our own spark arrestor. It looks pretty pretty trick. So now we got to go set that up on the roof. We're going to go ahead and put the... Uh, we got the panel up in here. We still have a little... Um, we didn't have a strip. So we got some temporary pieces in there. We're gonna just have to loosen yeah, up the screws the and, is ready for yeah, the and drop the seams. 
Like that's it. We're like one and a half pound away we get, from. All we got to do is just put our little uh, L brackets in this side, and it's ready to go. Put some screws here to hold the finishing collar in. But we got to panel all the. We're fully paneled now. Oh, and then Art Art painted the uh, AC unit. Looks trick. Ah, custom. I don't know if my paint job was that good. I told them last time my paint was some bicycle that I have maybe when I was 12 year old. Looks good. It's white all the way back. That's it. We're like panel and a half away from be done with the panels. Window is gonna be ready soon. All right, let's get back to work. <laughs> so close. All right, guys. It looks like hell. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the prettiest thing, but it's definitely, it's not going anywhere. That's it, we accelerate. L brackets around it. It's not moving, secure, outside, inside. Okay. This thing, four L brackets on the inside, four on the outside, all going into that aluminum pipe, or that square tubing that we put in there. It's not going anywhere. And then what we're gonna do, same thing as mine, because I did it the same way with the L brackets, because it's not the prettiest. We're gonna uh, build a, a beauty cover a little uh pro out of the white aluminum i would imagine just half circle something like that and uh wrap it around just to cover all this make it look pretty so we installed the last panel on the roof the last part of the panel so it's this back door we are looking for a vent we removed this ac and we're gonna install here another vent like one of those guys and then we left the cord for the AC. We have all the cords, we removed them. So in case we need it back, we're just gonna install a new NC back. We still don't know what's going on with this AC. It's just my pretty cover there for now. And now it's officially closing the, the flute of the oven with the... This is pretty exciting. With the door vent. If it wasn't for the rain, we'd be uh... sealing it tonight. Yeah. So this was the part that connecting the oven with the chimney pipe. It's called Duratec door vent finishing color adapter. That's it. We have less and less space here. And every wrong move is just a dent or scratch on the walls at this point. Well, guys, we are going to see you in a minute. Give you the final update. Final update of like this. We're working a lot tonight. Like it's it's taking a lot of hours. Those little like little things that you need to be precise and with all the precision and come up with solutions it's take so much time so uh hopefully it's helping somebody see you later